Welcome back, gang. In tonight's high school football two days preview, it's Norfolk Catholic Knight, who have historically been one of the best programs in Nebraska for the better part of four decades. But after an off 2019, the Knights bounced back in 2020 and are looking to keep that momentum in 2021. In 2019, Norfolk Catholic went three and six, missing the playoffs for the first time since 1995. Luckily for the Knights, their head coach Jeff Beller might be one of the best to ever do it. Not only in Nebraska, but nationwide. Beller brought his team back to the playoffs last season, and despite having to find a new quarterback and tailback, with 15 other starters coming back this fall, the Knights are excited for another underrated tool, depth. We'll be a little different in that aspect, but I think we're probably a little deeper than we were a year ago just in terms of, uh, of some of the guys that we have. I think uh, we have some nice depth in our offensive line. Uh, we have some depth at running back and receivers. So, so we do have some people. We do, some of them are young, and so we've got to just try to get them in some varsity experience and see how they, see how they handle that. As Coach said, that depth across the lines and skill positions will be huge for whoever ends up winning the starting quarterback spot. With six foot two senior Brendan Kelly as one of the team's top wideouts, and six foot five Preston Burbach back at tight end, add in a return turning set alignment for that extra protection, and it's pretty easy to see whoever takes over at QB is going to have a good set of weapons. We have a lot of returning linemen. We lost some, but we have a lot of. Uh, talented linemen coming back and then we have uh, Carter Kirkman or uh, Z back and uh, tight end coming back too so we have a lot of weapons on that offense and defense. At Brennan Kelly, Burbach, he's pretty tall. They all have good hands. Our linemen, they're pretty big and pretty good so I think that they'll do good this year. The Knights open their season at home next Thursday when they host Boone Central at 7 o'clock.